60-year-old Judge Juan Mershon, a former prosecutor, was first appointed to be a judge in Bronx Family Court by Mayor Bloomberg and elevated the state Supreme Court 14 years ago. He got Trump's case because of a rotation process in which judges are assigned to oversee grand juries. Attorneys and associates have had high praise for him as a jurist, characterizing him as a no-nonsense judge who is smart and even-tempered. Former prosecutor and defense attorney Imran Ansari thinks Trump should feel good about having Mershon handling his case. Judge Mershon is a hardworking judge. He comes from humble roots. He made his way through the DA's office as a prosecutor, and he's shown nothing but even temperament on the bench and a great knowledge of the law. Judge Mershon oversaw the tax fraud case against Trump's company and his longtime finance chief, Alan Weisselberg, who pled guilty in a plea deal that got him a five-month jail sentence in exchange for testifying against the company. After the Trump indictment was announced last week, the former president made it clear he believed Judge Mershon hates him, claiming he was, quote, handpicked by D.A. Bragg and the prosecutors and the same persons who railroaded my 75-year-old CFO Alan Weisselberg to take a plea deal. Although Trump may say he thinks that this judge hates him, there's no evidence or no prior history in the record to show that Judge Mershon has any animus to Donald Trump. In fact, during the Weisselberg trial, he appeared to be a pretty fair judge. There's a long road ahead in this unprecedented case. Many briefs, many appeals before it finally goes to trial. And when it does, the question remains whether it can really take place in such a liberal-leaning city. It is a real concern whether Donald Trump could get a fair trial in Manhattan. Just on a political basis, Manhattan leans heavily left uh, and therefore, there is a valid concern on the defense team to think, well, can Donald Trump get a fair trial? Even Trump's own attorneys didn't share his harsh words for Judge Bershon. Like a lot of New York judges, he has had experience with headline-making cases before. Though he hasn't scheduled the next court date until next December, you can expect a slew of motions and appeals in this historic case, which Trump's attorney Joe Tacopina said he doesn't believe will ever make it to a jury.